Jake Paul finally met his match when he found himself face to face with Iron Mike Tyson in the ring. What did we all expect? The YouTuber gets in the ring with the baddest man on the planet in Iron Mike Tyson. This was the humbling of a lifetime, ass. Jake Paul was so petrified that he wouldn't even dare look Mike Tyson in the eyes in the ring. Mike Tyson launched forward with his peekaboo style bobbing and weaving all of Jake Paul's sloppy punches. As Mike got up close and unleashed a barrage of attacks, subscribe so you don't miss out on any future fights and updates. As the YouTuber swung, Mike Tyson caught Jake Paul with a flush right hand, putting him onto the canvas. Once he felt the blows from Tyson, he knew he was doomed and quit by accepting his fate and getting knocked the F out by the right hand of Tyson. Build up to the fight between Jake Paul and Mike Tyson was steeped in anticipation and tension. Jake Paul, a YouTube sensation turned boxer, had made a name for himself by taking on a string of carefully selected opponents, often older and far past their primes. His brash demeanor and relentless self-promotion had won him legions of fans but it also made him one of the most polarizing figures in boxing. Paul had managed to market himself as an up and coming fighter, but many within the boxing community saw him as someone making a mockery of the sport by cherry picking his opponents in the lead up to this fight. Paul's bravado was at an all time high. He was confident that Mike Tyson, despite his legendary status, was just another retired fighter who could be added to. His list of victories on the other hand, Mike Tyson, a name synonymous with fear and respect in the boxing world, was a man whose very presence in the ring commanded reverence. Even at 58 years old, Tyson was far from being just another washed-up former athlete. He had once ruled the heavyweight division with an iron fist, knocking out opponents with a ferocity that few could match. Despite his age, Tyson was still in remarkable shape and carried with him the wealth of experience and knowledge that only a lifetime in the sport could provide. As the fight night approached, the atmosphere was charged with excitement. The arena was filled with fans, eager to witness what promised to be a spectacle. The contrast between the two fighters could not have been more pronounced. Paul the Young, brash internet star versus Tyson, the seasoned veteran and former undisputed heavyweight champion. The stakes were high, not just for Paul, but for the sport itself, many saw this as a moment of reckoning a chance for Tyson to show that boxing's true greats still stand head and shoulders above. The new wave of celebrity fighters. When the bell rang to signal the start of the fight, the atmosphere in the arena became electric. Tyson and Paul circled each other cautiously, but it quickly became apparent that Paul was in for a long night from the outset. Tyson's movements were measured and purposeful. Despite his age, he moved with the precision and intent of a seasoned predator. Paul, by contrast, looked unsure, his previous confidence beginning to falter in the face of the relentless pressure Tyson was applying. Paul tried to keep Tyson at bay with his jab, but it was clear that he was out of his depth. Tyson's defense was rock solid, and his head movement made it nearly impossible for Paul to land anything meaningful every time Paul threw a punch. Tyson either slipped it or counted with a devastating shot to the body. The difference in skill and experience was glaringly obvious, and it didn't take long for the crowd to realize that Paul was in trouble. Tyson, sensing weakness, began to turn up the pressure. His punches were precise and powerful, each one landing with a thud that reverberated throughout the arena. Paul, who had never faced an opponent of Tyson's caliber, was quickly running out of options. He tried to trade blows with Tyson, but the older man's power and precision were too much for him to handle Tyson's punches began to take their toll, and Paul's face quickly showed the signs of the beating he was taking midway through the first round. Tyson set a trap that would bring the fight to an explosive conclusion. After several powerful body shots, he fainted to the body again, causing Paul to lower his guard. It was the opening Tyson had been waiting for with lightning speed. Tyson unleashed a brutal right hand that connected flush with Paul's jaw. The punch was a thing of beauty perfectly timed, perfectly placed, and delivered with the kind of power that had made Tyson. Legend, in the first place, the impact was immediate and devastating. Paul's legs gave out beneath him, 
and he crumpled to the canvas in a heap. The arena erupted in a mix of shock and awe as the reality of what had just happened began to sink in the referee, quickly stepped in, waving off the fight without hesitation. There was no need for a count, Paul was out cold, and the fight was over. Mike Tyson had just knocked out Jake Paul in the most brutal and decisive way possible. The aftermath of the knockout was a stark contrast. Between the two fighters, Tyson, calm and composed, stood over his fallen opponent, his expression one of quiet satisfaction. He had come into the fight with something to prove, and he had done so in the most emphatic manner imaginable. Even at 58 years old, Tyson had shown that his power and skill were still very much intact. This wasn't just a victory. For Tyson, it was a statement, a reminder to the world that true greatness in boxing isn't something that fades with age. Jake Paul, on the other hand, was left humbled and defeated. The brashness and arrogance that had characterized his rise in the sport were nowhere to be seen. As he was, was helped to his corner. This was a harsh lesson for Paul, one that exposed the limits of his abilities and the dangers of underestimating a fighter of Tyson's caliber. In the weeks leading up to the fight, Paul had talked a big game dismissing Tyson at just another name on his hit list. But in the ring, all that talk had counted for nothing Tyson had systematically dismantled Paul, exposing him as a fighter who, while talented in his own right, was simply not on the same level as the tier legends of the sport. Tyson's victory was a triumph not just for himself, but for the sport of boxing as a whole in an era where celebrity boxing matches have become increasingly common. Tyson's knockout of Paul was a powerful reminder of what true boxing excellence looks like. It was a victory for the purists, for those who believe that the sport should be about skill, power, and respect, rather than just entertainment. And spectacle Tyson had shown that even in his late 50s, he was still a force to be reckoned with a man who could humble even the most confident of opponents with a single punch as the dust settled the fight was being talked about as one of the most significant moments in recent boxing history. Tyson's performance was hailed as a masterclass in the art of boxing, a display of power, precision, and experience that few could have predicted for Paul. The loss was a sobering experience, one that would likely shape the future of his boxing and career. He had come into the fight, believing that he could stand toe-to-toe -to -toe with a legend. But Tyson had shown him just how wide the gap was between a YouTube sensation and a true boxing grade. The fight also sparked a broader, conversation about the state of boxing in the modern era. While celebrity fights have undoubtedly brought new audiences to the sport, Tyson's knockout of Paul was a reminder that there is a level of respect and seriousness that must be maintained. Boxing is not just about entertainment. It is demanding unforgiving sport that requires skill, dedication, and above all respect for the opponents who step into the ring in the end. The fight between Mike Tyson and Jake Paul will be remembered as a defining moment in both of their careers for Tyson. It was another chapter in his story legacy, a moment that reaffirmed his status as one of the greatest and most feared heavyweights of all time for Paul. It was a humbling experience that exposed the limits of his abilities and the dangers of underestimating a true boxing legend. The image of Paul lying unconscious on the canvas knocked out cold by a man nearly twice his age will be an enduring symbol of the night, a reminder that in boxing, as in life, there are no shortcuts to greatness.